Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Darksiders War Mastered Edition! Like, uh, what we previously left, left off with is we defeated the mini, or the practice, Stygian, and we obtained Ruin. No, I cannot summon him right here. What are we going on with the level? This is a part that I also not quite enjoy. We have to use these guns again. And I don't, don't, don't enjoy it. Come, horseman. Come on. No, 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 no. I might go and run through it? Actually, is that a possibility? Die. No, 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 no. Nope, nope, nope! God, God fucking damn it, what? Fucking hell, fucking hell. Jesus Christ! And mostly because the starting point is just annoying as fuck. Having these two guys just going up towards me, oh, this is just so bullshit. <sighs> yeah, I need to be real quick to, to uh, handle that. Okay, mm, come on. Is that a health chest? I think it is. No, you die. Nope, I said you die. I think there are two health chests. Okay, so... Yeah, those... The enemies... You fight here in this section is just... I don't know why, it, 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 it won't work for me. Alright, is this everything for a while? Not a while. When I turn around this corner there will be more. But have I enough time to get this health chest? Mm, answer no. Wait, did that pass the health chest? Oh, hello! Sorry, I'm going to grab your soul chest. Going to real quickly just fight like this. I think we're pretty close to ending this gun section, but I don't like the things we have to fight. Those gunners, I don't really care about. Uh, those can be pretty easy. But the juggernaut and the axe-wielding dude can be quite... Nope, this is all. Alright, those are down. Oh, there's one more. <sighs> Come on. These juggernauts can be 
quite annoying. I think... Yes, I think we're pretty close. Yep. That is all. Don't underestimate this gun. Bye. I think now? Or now? I think after we kill these enemies, it should be done. Because there should be a lake underneath us. Yep, this is the end. Uh, is there a way to get up here? Now that I'm missing something. Hmm. I hope I'm not missing something that's that are up on those ledges. But it doesn't seem to be the case. I think I remember myself trying to get up these things as well in the beginning, in June. I think somewhere in this water section should be an artifact for us to grab. There we go, artifacts. Oh, oh, there we go, we thought for a second, where the hell is my pop-up? I know there's a pop-up. I have jumped out to the right side. I think I did. Not that I ended up at the wrong side. Let's get fighting! Oh, this. Come on, guys! Put some more back into it. Oh yeah, there we go, there's the Stygian. And there's Fulgrim. Perfect. There's the health chest. There is a health chest. Hello. Oh, plus a thousand. Ah, what should I buy? My sword. I don't have anything to use because stone skin and blade guys are is not something I would use in this boss fight. Again, Silitha as well. Uh, high impact round. I'm going to buy that. You are powerful. Uh, I'm going to buy the rest shard. And I have that you as well. Drive too hard a bargain, friend. And then I am buying two of these. You are as wise as you are powerful. Okay, let's go out and let's go into the menu. Let's see, only the Shredder and the Bane, so the next 10,000 are going to watch these things. Please, take your time. I think, should I, should I buy... No, 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 I, I, I have to wait with my souls, I'm going to buy the Bane and the Shredder you know first. I can help you. All right. Let's see. Ooh, then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
seven artifacts to, found, to be found. And we know that there's a champion artifact that we will get later. And there's one artifact that we that I forgot. So there's only actually six artifacts that we have to find throughout this uh, the game. And then we're done. Perfect. Let's see. So yeah, only the Shredder and Bane I want to buy. I think then I will upgrade at least Stone, stone Skin and Blade Geyser. And these things. What would you ask of this home? But the high impact rounds would be pretty useful because we have to fight the stitch unit now. I'm going to save of course. And I'm going to enter. Hello guys! Guys, we we'll just have to get in there and finish what they started. Let's kill these guys. Come on. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I heard that. That was the Wilhelm scream. Okay, uh, yeah. First thing we have to do is get the mask of the Stygian, because otherwise we cannot hit his weak spot. That's the wrong side, War. Come on. Is this mask still on or not? Oh yeah, he will summon three annoying bastards to help him in the fight. And they can get you off your horse pretty fast. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, wait, I can just shoot it. There's a Stygian. I 
think I have to find these three things first. Come on! How much bullets do these things take? Come on! Okay, n there we go. We fight the Stygian the same way like we did the other one. When we get the close, just boost up. And keep shooting, shooting, shooting. I think this is one of the more easier ones, to be perfectly honest. Because it's just shoot, 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 shoot. At least this arena is much bigger than the other one. So maneuverability is so much better. Come on, follow me. Come on, jump up. There we go. Come on, shoot, 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 boost, shoot, 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 boost, shoot, 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 shoot. Uh, come on, Sijin. Oh, wait, I don't have a boost. Yeah, keep your boost in check. Shoot, 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 shoot. Wait, already? All right. I thought it would have taken a little bit longer. Oh well. It's an eruption of blood. I still keep thinking that he, he he's destroying the hearts. Another extra health bar. Well, I guess there's nothing left to do but get the Stygian's heart back to Samael. Still, all these hearts, the power he'll get from them. I hope you know what you're doing. Return the heart to Samael. Samael. All right. Let's get to the serpent hole. And let's see. Uh, let's get to over here. Then I will go to the drone pass, get the artifacts that I forgot. And then go on to the iron canopy. Actually, the start of the iron canopy. And then the episode right there. Let's see if I do this. Not not falling, I want to jump. But it didn't trigger even when I was falling, so... This way. Oh, the enemies have finally spawned into this area.
Okay. Oh, hello. Hello. One more. Just one more. And then more. You get your tower. Silitha's web infested lair is far across the great chasm in the Ashlands. Ruin has yet to regain much of his strength, but he will make the distance. As for Silitha, just get there and she'll find you. The Broodmother is a collector of sorts. Most who enter her realm, she feeds to her young, the one she takes an interest in. <laughs> ah, those are the unlucky ones. Those she keeps alive, and they can live a long time. Long enough to tell her thing. You could say she collects stories, information. What stories will she tell me about you, Samael? Careful! Or your ending will be a tragic one. Sometimes the hero dies in the end. But Horseman, I like stories that have a happy ending. Now bring me the final heart. I like Samuel. Samuel. Soul Bridge. War can now access in one storm and soul bridge. Charge ruin through the pillars to activate them. Yep, we have to go back to the Ashlands. Where are you going? Jesus Christ, where the fuck were you going? Jesus Christ, you're just a bloody idiot. I don't know what the hell he was doing, but... <laughs> oh god. Let's get on to the site. Mm. There we go. Let's get to the drone pass. Get the item that I need. And go to Yeshland and to the Iron Canopy. Holy crap, I, <laughs> I didn't know <laughs> that, 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 that the uh, ex wooden dude could do that. At least I know how long he can charge his attack. So, dodging away for just a bit doesn't work. He will dodge, or he will follow you. Quite far. And let's Bravo, see. Horseman. Even the ash crawling creature didn't stand a chance. Over here there should be an artifact. There we go. Let's swim through all this and let's get back to the Ashlands. I think there are some items that we can get in the Ashlands. But I don't know if we have... I think we, for some of them we need the Iron Chain, but I'm not completely sure about that. Come on, when can I use... There we go. Let me use him. We 
Whee! I can finally use Ruin to get across. There we go. And Ashlands. Uh, before we do that, because I want to end in the Iron Canopy, there's the section over there that's still crossed off. I want to go to the dry roads, because I think a new mini boss will spawn there. We, you guys remember the jailer in the Twilight Cathedral? There will be one spawning there as well in the, the dry roads. And I want to fight that one is right now, at least. And I have that guy out of the way, and I only have to worry about other things spawning there. Like the Uriel boss fight. Should I call it the boss fight or a mini boss fight? I called her a mini boss fight uh, previously, so I don't know. Bravo, horseman. Even the ash crawling Stygian lies dead in your wake. Who can stand again? Okay, but I. Th I don't know if it's now or later that he will spawn. Since I don't hear trembling, I don't think he has spawned yet. I think we have to fight Silatha first to make that happen. And then I was mistaken. Whoa. Jesus Christ. That's a close call. Alright, take me to the Ashlands. I like these wormholes. These look so neat. And you can see the difference between each, each of the three people that can use them. Fulgrim has a blue variant. And sort of red variant has uh, Samael, and a yellow variant is being used by. What was his name again? An angel you will see in the prison. So, yeah. Over here, yep. The ash worm is gone. Completely gone. So you can actually walk into the sand without problem. I think this should be just over here. I'm going to grab this. Come on. Come on guys. Fly down. Come on. Get into my reach. I want to hit you with my weapons. Come on. Ah, oh, I will shoot you guys then. Let's see. There's one chest that I just picked up. Let's see if there's something else that I forgot. Or not forgot. Actually, can now grab in this area. Since the Stygian is gone, I can finally roam this area for free. Over here is a section. You have to come back here later anyways for the uh What? What the hell is I think that is one of those bombs that is in the shadow realm. So we cannot grab it until we have the mask of shadow for this section. Okay. 
that is in bust. Bet there are more sections in this area that I can go to. Over there we have the soul bridge. Actually, now that I'm here, I can actually sh show you guys what I was talking about later, uh, previously. Uh, let's see. Oh, over there, there, there's... Yep, crystals. And... Destroy. And a wrath chest. Always handy and dandy to have. I think we get one more Wrath Core when we complete the whole set of artifacts, but I'm not completely sure on that. Uh, over there, you can see two of those riders. If you go over here and then jump down this pit, look, you're seeing two. You're seeing two of them right now. I think... Oh, wait. Wait, what the... F I thought they were not able to come to here. On this platform. Okay, there are already four. Or there are three, I don't know. But when you jump down here, I will do that demonstrated right now. There should be more spawning. So if we come up, there should be two more. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Okay, there was there were four before. So now we have six. So this is the re this is the reason how you can a reason this isn't wait train or to get achievement horseback to get 150 or 160 kills on horseback I don't need it because I already have it and if you say how I already have it if this is my first time playing through the uh, core master edition, if I don't have, if I haven't said, said that already, it's because you could, for some reason you could load or import your previous save files from the, the the regular version of the game. So that happens. So I have some of the versions. I have some save files from the previous games that you just actually saw. I think I can perfectly show you right here. These, where I'm in the Black Throne and the Ashlands, are all when I actually played in the previous version of the game, in, in the regular version. Those are those save files that got just ported in into this game. But I have not played through it, so I, some of the achievements I just haven't got. I only did that... I use the save files to get the horseback achievements, because that one is pretty annoying. Like, to get 100 miles on uh, Ruin. I didn't want to get through the game again to get Ruin. Luckily I had a save file that already just got Ruin. And I used that to get the achievements. Because it's just so bloody annoying to get that one. But yeah, that's the only things I use that achievement for are the, the save files for. To be honest, I n n nothing else. What the hell just killed? What the hell just died? And and there we go. Good scene.
the iron canopy. So we're finally there, on the way to fight the last boss, uh, the last of the four chosen. Nah, the fifth one we don't need to get the art from, but these four, the last one is close by, we can already see it, but it's being protected by four guardian seals. So, I think I'm going to end this episode right here. Like always, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and don't forget to get your game on. Hulk Smash! <laughs>